November is an annual long event involving the growing of moustaches during the month of November to raise awareness, prostate cancer and other male cancers and other associated charities. The name was formed by a Portman new word for moustaches and November. The goal of November is to change the face of men's health. By encouraging men to get involved, November aims to increase early cancer detection, diagnosis and effective treatment and ultimately reduce the number of preventable deaths. Since 2004, the Movember Foundation charity has run Movember events to raise awareness and funds for men's health issues such as prostate cancer and depression. In Australia and New Zealand, in 2007, events were launched in Ireland, Canada, Sism Republic, Denmark, Spain, the United Kingdom, Israel, South Africa, Taiwan and the United States. It has spread from Australia to South Africa, Europe and North America. In 2010, Movember merged with a testicular cancer event, Tashback. In 2012 for Movember, many different celebrities took part in it. For example, Robert Downey Jr., Brad Pitt, Daniel Craig and George Clooney. What do you think about facial hair? It's not too bad, but some can be excessive. How much facial hair can you grow? A pretty decent neck beard. Do you like facial hair on yourself? Not really, I look like a tramp. And how old were you when you were able to start growing facial hair? About 16. <laughs> Do you think puberty is a big part of growing facial hair? Yes. What's your favourite style of facial hair and why? The Satan goatee. It's a bit different. Do you find on some people it takes longer and on some people it takes less time? Yes. What do you think of No Shave November? It's a pretty good cause. Have you ever taken part in it before? I started it, but I had to have a shave. And what also, just to finish off the interview, um, what style of facial hair do you normally have or do you prefer clean shaven? Um, after a week I usually have pretty good stubble, that's about it. And anything else you want to say about facial hair? No, not really. The World Beard and Moustache Championship is a worldwide event which was first hosted in Germany in 1990 where men from all around the world take part to show their facial hair and see who's got the longest facial hair and the best styled facial hair. The championship has hosted in many different countries over the past 20 years, for example, such as Carston City in the USA, Brighton in England, Nostrem Norway and Astrage in Alaska. The event is normally held in Germany, which the championship started in. There are three different brackets of facial hair in the championship, which are the moustache, the partial beard and the full beard, which are broken up into different categories. Here are some examples of the different facial hairs that people grew to take part in the championship. Natural moustache, freestyle, the full beard with salt moustache, the sideburns and the Hungarian moustache. What do you think about facial hair? Um, I think it's uh, pretty good. Um, I've recently just started growing it and yeah, I think it looks um, really good on like certain people. I think it suits certain people. And how much facial hair can you grow? Um, this is the first time I've really started like growing it out. I've never really started um, like I've mostly been shaving it off most of the time. But at the moment, I'm growing like a full beard. So yeah. And do you like the facial hair on yourself? Uh, yeah, I think it suits me um, a lot more than just me being clean shaven. I think it uh, kind of just shows character a bit more. And to be honest, I can't really be bothered to shave. So yeah, I think I like it. And how old were you when you um, started to be able to grow facial hair? Um, probably 15, around about that, 15, 16. Uh, 16 was when it first started, like, fully coming, like, coming in. But yeah, around 15. And do you think puberty is a big part of growing facial hair? Uh, yeah, I think so, because, of course, you don't see a lot of, like, 12-year-olds with, like, massive beards going around. So, yeah, I think, like, you know, when you hit around the 15, 16 mark is when you first start growing a beard. So, yeah, I think it's a big thing. And uh, what's your favourite style of facial hair and why? Um, I think just the full beard because I think you can do a lot with that. Like I've seen a lot of people like dye their beards like multicoloured and stuff like that, and I think you can do like a lot of styles with just the normal beard. And do you find it takes some on some people it takes them longer, and some people it takes less time to grow facial hair? Yeah, I think so. I I don't really know why, but like for me, it only it's only taken about um, it's taken me about a month to grow it to this uh, length. I have shaved it a bit, but. It has taken me about a month, um, but in a couple of weeks it uh, started like growing in. While some people like it takes about a couple, like six months to actually grow something like really good. And have you ever heard of um, No Shave November? Yes, I um, did that last month. I think it was. Uh, yeah, um, I did that last month, and uh, yeah, it was uh, really good. So I, you enjoyed doing it then? Yeah, yeah, I really enjoyed it. Um, it was cool, pretty much like waking up every day and going, oh, I've got more, I've got more of a beard today. 
And also, um, just to finish off the interview, what style of face shower do you normally have, or do you just prefer your face clean shaven? Um, well, as I said, this is like the first time I've really started growing a beard, but I think I prefer it more like this, and just as a normal beard. Just and is there anything else you want to say on facial hair? Um, no, I just think it looks really good on certain people, and yeah, I like it. Thank you for watching this documentary on facial hair. I hope you found it informative. Stay tuned for other videos I'm posting in the future.